I was eight. And <laughs> my mom <laughs> never took me to school. She never fed me. She never took me a bath. She she always left. She always left. She left me. It's hard. It's hard. It's hard. It's hard. It's hard talking about it. And I was only eight. And I used to watch people do their do bushes outside. Bushes, windows. I used to peek in people's houses. I used to break into people's homes. I was only eight. I had no mom. I had no dad. I had no family that cared about me. And at eight years old, I knew that I just wanted to understand people more. And why they did certain things. <laughs> my life is far from normal. Everything I've been through in my life is far from normal. <sighs> and I made my magazine. Because I love people so much. <laughs> I love when people are able to wake up every day. And work on their music, the modeling, producing, videography. It is very intriguing when people are focused on themselves. And they can make their dreams come true. They have all of this ambition and all of this energy. And all of, all of them. Everything about them. I came out with my magazine. And every time I tell people, I want to write about you, or I want to write, make you the cover of my magazine, people get so happy with me. And they tell me it was their dream. They tell me how much it means to them that they never knew that they would be in a magazine. And that stuff keeps me going. It keeps me going and going and going and going and going. But then I have days like this where I don't understand what's going on anymore. My body... Is empty. The only thing I feel is sadness in my heart. I wish it was different. I just wish my childhood was different. Because I've been through some traumatic shit. I've been through a lot of traumatic stuff. And I'm scared of people. I'm scared. I'm scared to talk. People always assume with me. They don't know me. My intentions are always pure. Are always pure. I just want to know about people and, and love you and spread your name and support you. Because I never had that. I never had that. I went to so many shows and I performed on stage. And I invited my family to come see me. They live in Atlanta. They never came. They never came. And I hate them. I hate them for it. I hate them for never supporting me. Your family. It's who you choose. Not what you was born into. You get to pick and choose your family. I'm tired of people getting the wrong picture of me. I'm tired. I'm so tired. If I didn't have kids, I just would want to sleep all day. Not deal with this pain of uncertainty.